You ready? Okay, I'm gonna hold up these like this. Okay. You ready? Yeah. That's good. One, One two, two, three, three. action. <laughs> Welcome back, Waxer Squad, to the channel, you guys. Today, you guys, we got a seafood feast. My mm -hmm. husband fried some, babe, tell them what we got. You tell them what we got. I fried I'm some my good, good red snapper. Yeah, fry red snapper and um and some broccoli over here. I'm saying and bean. Uh -oh. yeah, yeah, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good Jamaican fry. And then fish. I got some snow crab over here. I got me a fry fish back here. We have our leftover oxtails because you know I was gonna tear them up today, honey. And then um I made me a, a little bit of olive oil and butter uh, sauce. So you guys, we're going to say grace and then we are going to get all of this stuff situated so that you guys can see us eat better. All right. Yeah, my. Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, I thank you for this food. I thank you. I ask that you bless the hands that have prepared it. Lord, let it be nourished to our bodies. Take out all impurities. Lord, I ask that you bless every single supporter, oh God, or anybody watching this video, Lord. Add a blessing to their household, oh God. Lord, I ask that you take us into this weekend, but never from your presence, that you protect us and our loved ones, oh God, and bring us back at the appointed time. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. amen. All right. We'll be right back. Back. This is Waxing with Donisha and Cliff, and we ain't came to play. We be waxing every, every day, day, different foods, different, different ways. If you're new, hit subscribe, leave a comment down below. Don't be shy. Come along for the ride. Why? Because this is the Waxer Squad. The Waxer Squad. The Waxer 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 Squad. All right. We already said grace. Let's get in. Cause my snow crabs is getting cold. All right. I'm trying to eat, baby. Mm hmm. Yes. Oh, but that sauce is hot still. So we hope mm -mm. and pray. Now y'all doing well. We are extremely hungry, y'all. My fish. Um, today. Because we literally did not eat anything today. And it is. 3.35 p.m. Yeah. In the afternoon. So we are extremely hungry. Um, I think the reason why I have not been eating breakfast is because I started taking some med some pills, um, some sea moss. It's sea moss, burdock root, and wormwood. It's like a um, y'all know what sea moss is. And what I think it's doing to me is it's curbing my appetite. So when I eat, I get full faster. Um, I have more energy when I do, like throughout the day. I have more energy to get stuff done, even like when I'm actually like super tired. As soon as I take that sea moss. I'll be going, I just I, I'll be ready to go. I'll be ready to go. Now this week I've been a little bit, I have been a little bit down because y'all know what had happened. So I ain't really <clears throat> been doing too much. My husband has been picking up the slack with the kids, with my daughter. But I'm feeling better now. And I prayed and I gave all my worries, all my problems. I gave them to the Lord and he's fixing it. I also got me a fried fish down here. Y'all Y'all ain't gonna be able to see it, but cause there's so much stuff up here. So mm -hmm. God been, gotta be careful about them bones now. God been helping me y'all. And I have started to feel better. So I want to get back on my schedule um, of um, just trying to be a better mother, you know, spending more time with my daughter. And I don't know why y'all, but I was craving the tomato too. Mm -hmm. So I got a tomato right here. Just spending more time with my daughter, you know. So I'm getting back and on getting back on that. Cause she's three. 
and she needs her mom more often. And this week, Clifton been Clifton been doing everything, cause I literally had been like a big baby all week long, and just uh, crying a lot and not in the mood. Literally, everything stopped. It seemed like everything stopped in my life this week. Everything. But like I said, I had still been taking my um weight loss pills. Well, they're not weight loss pills. CMOS is just like a supplement. But it feels like a weight loss pill. Mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm Because... Like I said, they had you out here have your whole appetite curved, straight up gone. And you'll look up, you'll be like, wait a minute, it's 2 o'clock. I ain't even ate yet. I ain't ate nothing. Yeah. So, that's what been going on. Um, mm. Mm -mm. I also want Everybody who's new and returning to know that me and my husband have officially got a new address for you guys to send anything you would like to send to us. Mm-hmm. So, whatever you send, just direct it as, direct it, send it to, I mean, make the attention to Waxing with Donisha. Um... It is not like a normal P.O. box. So you can, so it accept, we accept any carrier. Mm -hmm. Any carrier that you send from, we are able to accept it. It's not like a regular P.O. box where you can only accept, accept certain, certain things from certain carriers. We do all, it, it, we do all carriers. So. Please feel free. I'm also going to be advertising um, small businesses, small business owners. So if you would like, if you have a product that you would like me to um, showcase on my channel, um, send it, go ahead and send it to me. Um, you can be a big business owner as well, but put it this way. If you're a business owner and you got products that you want me to push for you, just send it to me Yeah, and email me. My email address is in the description box below. Um, you can also email me on Instagram. I am very good at responding to Instagram messages. Very good at that. About checking my Instagram messenger. As well as my email. I check both at least once a day. So go ahead and send me stuff. If y'all um, would like to. Also, I am now on Clubhouse. So... I'm going to post it in the community post, but for those of you who don't ever go to my community post, my clubhouse name is going to come across the screen right now. That is at Waxing with Donnie. Mm -hmm. it's Donnie. It's Waxing with Donnie instead of Waxing with Donisha because they wouldn't let me, um, you could only use 16, 16 characters for your uh, username. So, wax it with Donnie. So, Donnie should just with D O N I. D O N I. Wax it with D O N I. So, you guys, come and follow me on Clubhouse. Um, I'm going to make it a point to start figuring out how to access it better. I'm getting ready to become more familiar with it. I'm going to start going to like joining people's Ooh. live streams and discussions. And 
excuse me. If you guys had guys, any um look at this fish. Mm -hmm. Fishy fishy. Um if you guys have any uh what you call it? What you call it? Mm -hmm. You guys have any people that you follow or any organizations that you follow on Clubhouse and you think it would be beneficial to me in growing my business um, or just informational, please go ahead and leave me a comment down below. I think I'm going to link my Clubhouse handle. I think I'm going to link, link it below. Yeah. To make it easier for people. For the ones who leave the comment. I'm also mm -hmm. going to add it to the description box, too. So, yeah, y'all. 2021, we working harder. And we getting things in order in this house and in our lives, you know. Mm -hmm. So, we can be more of a blessing to other people. Yeah. And, um... So that we can be blessed as well. But mainly to be blessing other people. Because I know that's why God put me here. And all the hell and high water that I personally have had to go through. I know it's, it's, it's a purpose in it. And I'm ready for God to show me that purpose. The more. Mm -hmm. And what I know is, is that if I can watch other people get their lives in order, get their finances in order, their home in order, have a schedule of like how they got, you know, people, business people yeah. who ain't got no time to play games and got a lot going on in their life. So they schedule everything and they got everything in order. Mm hmm. God is not a go to the dog here. God is not a God of chaos. He is a God of order. So when everything in your life is out of order and confusing and just all over the place, so God is not, something is wrong. And, mm -hmm. and, and, and you need to you need to be able to pay attention to that. It's so good. You need yep. to pay attention to that. And you need to ask God to help you bring order to your chaos. And that's what we've been asking God to do. I know I have for the past two years. And it's a lot of work. I'm not going to lie to you. But one thing I know, you just got to start. You can't be afraid of doing it because you don't know how to do something or because you're feeling like it's going to take a long time or you don't know what to do. You just got to start from where you do know, from where you do know what to do. You just got to start. You can't let, you want some more uh, vegetable? Mm -hmm. Go ahead, grab it. You can't let none of that stuff be an excuse. You just got to start, y'all. You can't just pray. You got to pray and move. My favorite scripture I used to repeat all the time a year ago was, faith without works is dead. Yeah. And that means that if you believe in God for something in your life, but you're not putting in no effort, yeah. you can keep on believing all you want. But ain't nothing going to change in your life until you take the first step. Because God ain't waiting on us. I mean, we ain't waiting on God. God is waiting on us. Mm -hmm. You hear me? God's not waiting on you. Um, 
I mean, you not wait. You not waiting on God. Let me slow down because I'm hungry and I'm <laughs> going too fast. Hold on. Slow down, baby. Slow down, baby girl. Um. Yeah, you're not waiting on God. God waiting on you. You're not waiting on God. God is waiting on you to get a clue. He waiting on you to decide that you are ready to move to the next level because everything he's promised you is already there. Standing at every single, every single door and every single level that you are supposed to climb to in life, your blessing is already at that door and it's right in front of you. You got to take the first step to walk towards that door. And once you walk through one door, you'll be able to walk through each door in a sequential order according to the purpose God has put in you. So you don't have to be fearful and you don't have to worry and you don't have to uh, be afraid. And you don't have to know everything. I was watching Joyce Meyer on TV yesterday and she kept... She was talking about suffering and, 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 and you know, the scripture that says God is not the author is first Corinthians chapter 14, verse 33. God is not the author of confusion, but of peace for God is not the author of confusion, but he's the author of peace. And so no matter what you're going through in your life, there are going to be times where you things just don't make sense to you. But if it don't make sense to you, don't try to worry yourself trying to figure out how or what. Because that's what I was doing. Mm -hmm. What I went through on New Year's, it didn't make no sense to me. And I kept trying to figure out, well, God, well, what's going to happen next? But it's like some things you are never going to know. You just got to be ready for it. And how you get ready for the next level in your life is that you just put your faith and your trust in God. You have to put your whole complete faith and trust in him and say, God, no matter what happens or no matter what's on the other side, I trust you. And I know that I'm your child and you love me and you and, and, and I know that everything that good work that you have begun in me, you are faithful and just to complete it. So that means that I'm going to put my faith in you and my trust in you during trials and tribulations because he promised us we were going to go through them. We were all, everybody got to go through trials and everybody got to go through tri tribulation. Yep. It is prom It's one thing that is promised to you, but Amen. you got to know that God is holding your hand through all of that. He's going to hold your hand through it. He going to be a peace in the middle of your storm. Why are you going through it? Yeah. So trust him y'all. Ooh. I love the fish and fish and fish and Basically, what I'm trying to say is don't worry about what you don't know. Focus on what you do know. Say that one more time. Don't worry about what you don't know. Focus on what you do know. Because what you don't know, he knows. And he will figure it out for you. He'll help you figure it out. Just focus on what you do know, you know? So that's what me and my husband is doing. I know I am. I can't always speak for him, but I can for sure Amen. speak for me. And I know that's what I'm doing in my life. I'm focusing on what I do know. Mm -hmm. yeah. And less on what I don't. Period. Mm. Mm. Not done yet. So yeah. So yeah, y'all. That's that. Mm -mm. That is that. Everything good. Man. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, yeah. What's this one? Mm, 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 mm. This is good. Wow. And my sauce I made is jumping. Jumping? Jumping, jumping. <laughs> she said the sauce is jumping like a fry. Jumping, jumping. Mmm.
Mm -hmm. Oh my God. My crab jack. You make a mess over there? Mm -hmm. I dropped my crab. We're going to have to get a new setup. Mm -hmm. mm. Real soon, y'all. Mm. Real soon. Because this, eating this high up, ain't working for mm -hmm. me no more. Mm -hmm. I'm tired. It's lovely. It was cute in the beginning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not cute anymore. You know? Yeah. It's not. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Oh. Real cute. <laughs> that can we have that now? Can, can come that goes over us. Mm-hmm. It's supposed to come to off to the side and like hang over. Yeah. All right, you guys. So we are going to give away um don't don't talk about my daughter's hair. Don't talk about my daughter's hair. <laughs> Uh, no, I'm still on the video. I'm finna give away this give away this stuff. So you guys, we are gonna give away two Instagram, not Instagram. Can mommy finish talking, baby? Mommy talk really fast. You want to tell them something? Yeah. Okay, what do you want to tell them? My mommy call my hair ribbons. Your mommy need to comb your hair again. Your hair is not combed anymore. It is a mess. Call call Henry. Um, can I finish saying what I got to say, please? Okay, thank you. Can you have a seat before you fall today? Good girl. Good girl. All right. So, you guys, as you know, we have a $50 giveaway. I'm giving away $50 a piece to two people on YouTube, two people on Instagram, and two people on Facebook. So, um, I've randomly picked two people off of my community post on Face YouTube. We're So, we're going to do that right now. And um, we're going to give other people an opportunity. If you have not entered on Instagram, you can enter on Instagram as well if you don't win right now. And if, and if you don't win Instagram, you can also enter on Facebook um, as well if you are a, a friend of mine on Facebook. If not, then um, I don't know how many more friends I can accept, but my Facebook name is also in the description box below. So um, the first winner is going to be one independence day and the in the youtube and and, and I, it'll appear right here i'll put the instagram not the instagram the cash app handle right here so congratulations to you congratulations to you and the second person who's going to win the 50 dollars is Dimples 696, 696, and I will have your Insta, your Facebook, your Cash App handle right here as well. So those are the two winners for um, this uh, giveaway. There will be more giveaways in the future. Don't worry, and it will not and it will not take as long. But like I just said, there is still two more chances. There is still two more chances for you to win um, on Instagram. So all you have to do is go to my Instagram, figure out which post I ask people to drop their cash app handles. Um, hint, hinting to you, it's one of the seafood uh, boils that I did recently did. And then, like I said, if you want to go to my Facebook, if I can accept you as a friend, go ahead and um, look at my kids. Lord have mercy. Go ahead <laughs> and... Uh, Click on my link to my Facebook um, in the description box below and you can go to the post that I posted, uh, drop your cash apps there and drop yours there as well. All right, you guys, so congratulations to the winners and we are getting ready to get up out of here, you guys. Uh, we love you guys so much. Have a very, very, very good beginning of the week and blessed weekend, okay? We love you so much, Waxter Squad. Say peace. Peace.